Hey, how's everybody doing today? So I finally got my Samsung Galaxy Note 7 in. Today is August 24th, but I actually got this five days ago, but I was out of state. Now, as you may know, there was no Note 6. Basically, it was Note 5, and they jumped right up to the Note 7. And you can see that it comes with a 5.7 quad HD Super AMOLED display. It is 12 megapixel dual pixel main camera the note 5 was 16 megapixels so they bumped it down one more and this one the note 7 is actually ip68 dust and waterproof resistant now the note 5 didn't have it but it's just like the samsung galaxy s7 i did a lot of uh tests in the ocean and salt water and everything worked perfectly fine some other new features is the iris scanner. Basically, you can unlock your phone now with the Galaxy Note 7, which is the uh, the first Galaxy phone that you're able to do this. Uh, you only get a 64 meg memory on the Note 7. However, on the Note 5, you had an option of getting like 32, 64, or 128. But with the Note 7, it only comes with 64 megs of internal memory. However, you are able to expand that memory with an SD card up to 256 gigabytes opposed to the Note 5 you weren't able to ex there was no expandable memory period and of course you get the wireless charging as well as the uh, fast charging too so let me go ahead and open this up you can see the box here and I got Coral Blue check it out so let me go ahead and peel this off and then go ahead and boot this up Take this off. Let me go ahead and take this part here off. There we go. And if you can take a look, look here, and let me go ahead and start booting this up. And then let me go ahead and see what's in the box here comes with uh, this one's from T-Mobile for me so I got it um, a uh, sim card with this now the thing is I paid 950 US dollars out the door tax and everything for this phone um, it does come with uh, because I pre-ordered it I get like um, I have a choice between like a one year of free Netflix or I can get a free 256 gig SD card or I could basically get the uh, Samsung watch I'll probably go ahead and get the uh, Samsung watch and you can see here it comes with the key ejection tool Let's see here so here is the key ejection tool basically for your sim card and it comes with the startup guide and some information about how to transfer from your old phone to the new S7, some safety and warranty guide here in terms and conditions. Let me just put that aside. And of course you're going to get headphones, white headphones. And we have the fast adaptive charging. And I'm very curious to see how fast it'll charge compared to the um, previous, the Note 5, as well as the Samsung Galaxy S6 and S7 and the edges because they have fast adaptive charging as well. Now another thing that's new about this Note 7 is they have a USB type C. Check it out. This will be the new standard soon, guys. And the previous, all the previous Galaxies basically had the standard micro USB port opposed to the, uh, the USB type C, as you can see here. And again, this will be standard soon. Actually, I have a Another phone that I just previously got, the Nexus 6P, and they just came out with the, the USB Type-C as well, and it's reversible. You can see the difference between the, uh, the Note 7 and the USB Type-C on my Huawei uh, Nexus 6P. So that'll be the new standard uh, sooner than you think. And of course it comes with the cables, with the uh, Type-C adapter here. You have an OTG adapter. You can basically use this to transfer from your old phone to your new, Oats, new uh, Note 7 here. And here's another adapter. Basically, you can use this with your, if you're still, if you lose your camera or whatnot, you can still use your regular um, micro USB 
cable here and uh, plug that in here and type put in your um, USB type C into your uh, note 7 so you just get the micro USB and you pop it in there and then you can still you're still able to charge it uh, let's see what else we have in here okay I'm not even sure uh, what this is but that looks like it's pretty much it and again here is the note 7 just booted this up and here's the Samsung Galaxy S7 here and you can kind of see the size comparison here and it does come with a, um, a 3500 milliamp battery which is uh, larger than the previous Note 5. I think the Note 5 had like a 3000 milliamp battery. So anyways again this is the uh, blue coral here and I'm going to be doing a lot of testing on here versus all the other previous Samsung Galaxy phones as well as some other uh, as well as the iPhone and everything else. And that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching guys. Bye.